Greetings from the Toy Insanity Toy Vault. Doing a Marvel Monday because uh, basically I'm just getting rid of the packaging. Uh, these Marvel Mini Legends, Marvel Little Legends. I don't know what people call them. I think most people probably just still call them the Infinite Series. But I got Morbius, Living Laser, Hydro Man, Rogue, Ant Man, Daredevil, Quasar. And Wasp. This one is still in packaging that says Infinite Series. So I think this line started in like 2008. It was a very long lasting, extensive line, and I think they killed it off last year. The last packs I saw, they did two two packs for Spider Man Homecoming and one two pack for uh, Thor 3. They didn't do anything for Black Panther, they didn't do anything for Avengers 3. It's a cool little series, especially if you don't have room or the budget for the the Big Legends figures. Lots of awesome detail in these. So many points. So many points of articulation. Cool little bios. Although she's capable of storming into battle as a 100-foot giant, Janet Van Dyne prefers to flit through the fight at insect scale. Many villains have underestimated the Wasp, but few have escaped her, the excuse excruciating blast of her sting yeah, I did not collect that wave except I do have that Hulk somewhere this was 2013 and then for some reason they just started calling them legends just like the larger series Hank Pym suits up for battle as the half inch hero Ant-Man and I have Living Laser here and Daredevil and then these other ones are another wave. Morbius, Quasar, Hydra Man. Rogue can absorb the superhuman abilities of others, making her powers nearly unlimited. Okay, remember, it was uh, X-Men, X-Men, X2 or X3. They're like, uh, guys, I'm going to take the pill. What was it, a pill or a shot? I'm going to get the shot, so I'm not a... Freaking mutant that kills everybody when I when the moment I touch them and uh, Storm's all like No rogue, you're not taking the pill because there's nothing wrong with you. We can't let them control us kind of stuff And she's just like fool. I kill everyone I touch. That's my ability I think I want to be normal and not kill people when I give them a handshake Marvel Monday. T posing. All Rogan. Hawk Hogan. Joe Rogan. All right, whatever. Ant Man. Wasp. Daredevil. Daredevil has superhuman radar senses that let him detect his enemies before they strike. Also in this series, Living Lazar. That's cool looking, right? With masterful control of photon energy, the living laser is a formidable villain. <laughs> oh, and then uh, before those two packs they did last year, they did those comic two packs. Those had some decent figures. With his ability to transform his body into water, Hydra Man takes down the good guys with tidal force. So he's Sandman, but with water. And Morbius. When I was a kid, I thought Morbius was cool. Just because, look, oh, vampires. A nightmare's villain, this living vampire. Blah, 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 blah. Blade's gonna get you. Did they do Blade in this series? The coolest ones I remember from this series, they did She Hulk, Red. Sh did they do Red She Hulk? They did She Hulk. They did uh, Shadow Cat. They did two versions of Abomination. They did the blue one. They did Scar, Hulk's son, with superhuman energy, Quasar. Quasar shoots across the sky faster than the speed of light. Faster than the speed of what? Get the freak out of here. They did the two-pack, the comic pack with that cool Groot. 
It's like the older group. Anyway, guys, this is Marvel Monday, and this is all I'm doing because I just... I just need to get these in the little baggies. I don't have room anymore for stuff in packages. This is my favorite one here. Have you guys seen the movie? Have you seen the Ant-Man and Wasp movie? Guys, do you, do you love my movie? I'm trying to think of the actress's name from Lost. Man, I can't think of her name. All right, all right, all right. Enough of that. <laughs> Enough of that, guys. We're a family channel. Okay, you know what I'm saying? Knock it off. Knock it off.